yeah, I'm thankful to just be able to come and, and put a smile on their face and give them uh, a bright, of, a bright a, a shine of light in whatever their situation is, whatever they may be going through. Um, very fortunate. How much of a bright light are they to you? I mean, you're, you're standing up on that balcony up there shouting, Dak, Super Bowl, how much of a bright light is that to you? It, it's huge. Uh, I feel like anytime I come to do this, you, you know that you're, com you're coming to have an impact, but I don't think the people ever realize the impact that they have on me and that they have on all of us. Uh, as you just said, just showing their support, their unconditional support, um, and just their belief. And as you said, just hearing them say it from up top, or just when I'm passing, them, uh, passing out things, dapping them off, and, um, just continuing to for them to be saying motivating words to us is it's, it's awesome and that's uh, that's what this is, is about and that's why I encourage anyone that has the platform and ability to give back to make sure that you do that because uh, it's very rewarding for you as well. You guys have that the last couple of years because of the pandemic. How good is the family be able to get out and do these sort of things? Yeah, it's great. I mean, obviously, that was, uh, the pandemic hurt a lot of this world and. Um, it put a hinder on great moments like this of just being able to come and to share love and be able to, to spread and, as I said, put a smile on somebody's face despite what they've got going on in their life um, and just take them away from that for a moment is, uh, as well for, for us. I mean, you, you lose a game, uh, you know you're saying you're down and out, and then you come in here and you realize a different perspective and you know uh, how, how important these things are in life and it sometimes um, brightens you up and makes you, makes you understand and uh, realize that, that it's much bigger sometimes than the wins and losses, and uh, it's important just to, to give. Zach was saying, Trey, that a lot of times during the season, you don't get out and see many people. And this is one of the few times, really, in the season you do. Just how, how meaningful is it to, to when you are out as a group of guys away, but you aren't that often, you get to do something? Yeah, it's great, uh, as you said, especially during the season. Um, being a guy that likes to keep a lot of the things uh, in the season, just strictly football, uh, but when you take the time out to do this, as I said, the support that you realize from the city and the support that you realize from, from these men and women in tough situations and just, uh, as I said, giving us insp uh, ins inspirational words and motivating us, just continue to go on and letting us know how much uh, the games and just that uh, those Sundays and Thursdays mean to them. Uh, it's fun and it's a blessing just to be able, as I said, get that change of perspective in the midst of uh, what we've got going on in our world. Did you find yourself rooting for Washington last night? Of course. Uh, <laughs> Of course, um, but but that that's that's that game once again just shows what the NFL is about. Uh, you got to go in week in and week out, respect your opponent, and those guys uh, played well last night. Uh, and then, uh, obviously it'll help us to put this in a better position. But at the end of the day, no, not around here. But at the end of the day, uh, it's about controlling. We can control um, those things are going to happen, and we know those things are going to happen. So it's important for us to stay focused and uh, be our best. On the flip side, was it also a missed opportunity for you guys because of? You win, you know, you're one step closer to them. Yeah, sure. I mean, you can definitely say that. Uh, but once again, you didn't know that those guys were losing. So that's why it's important for us to control, control, we control, control our destiny. Uh, win and take care of the things that we can and watch what happens around us. And uh, when you win on Sundays, you come and you see that, you move up. And when you don't, you're sitting in the same spot. So we just got to stay focused on what we've got, what we're building. And I, I know we'll do that. These last 24 hours again, what happened in Green Bay and what happened in Philly last night. Does that show that the conference is wide open? We just got to worry about this, do our business, and this thing is, is there for the taking? Yeah, exactly. Uh, just seeing that the way the NFL is playing out this year. Um, as I said earlier in the week, you can't win on paper. Uh, and that's showing that week in and week out. Definitely showed it this Sunday. And so it's, for, it's important for us, as I say, control we can control, take care of our business, win all the games in front of us, and watch what happens around us. And I'm sure we'll be in a great position. How tough was Sunday for Mike McCarthy? I mean, I can't speak for him. I know it was tough for the team. As I said, we wanted to win that one for him. We wanted to lay another brick for what we've got going. We weren't able to accomplish that. Uh, but we've got to move on. I know, I know that's, that's who he is. I know that's who we are as a team. And that's what we're going to do. Thank you all. Thank you.